Why, hello everyone. Angela O'Hare here, your favorite and only Las Vegas realtor. And today I have Damien with me. We're doing model home tours in the newest KB community called um, Talis. Over here in the northwest part of the Las Vegas Valley, right off of Kyle Canyon Road, on the way to Mount Charleston. This community opened up three months ago. Can you believe it? And I'm just getting a video out now. And I'll, honestly, I didn't know it existed and shame on me for that. But anyway, they have the reserves and the landings here. And they have six floor plans for each of the collections. They have a total of five homes modeled. We're taking a look at the reserves collection right now, which is model 1634. They do have two different elevations and this community is more modern. Um, like they have the modern contemporary and then they also have the mid-century modern roof lines with the asymmetrical roof lines. I like the elevations here. So this plan 1634 is 1634 square feet, single story with three bedrooms, two baths, two car garage, and base price is starting at 392,890. This is just the base price that does not include any upgrades or structural options or the lot premium. They do have in this reserves collection four single story homes and two of the larger two story homes. So when you walk in, you're greeted by a kitchen. So you have your kitchen as you walk in. And it's kind of like a galley kitchen in a way because it's going straight on back with a desk here, which is kind of interesting. Instead of, a table. Instead of a table, I would probably put a nice little round kitchen table. Great, these people are coming. So it looks like they went with the builder grade quartz countertops. I don't know if these are an upgrade or not, these cabinets. And then the Whirlpool appliances. Ceramic tile flooring. Yeah, the ceramic tile flooring. I like the sink and then the window. It's kind of an odd position though, I think. I would probably would want my sink to be right here. I don't know, I just think it's a weird positioning, in my opinion. Then you have the dining room area and then the family room or the great room. So this community has 231 homes. The monthly HOA is $65. It is a gated community and there will be a community park. There are no SIDS or LIDS. So you have the laundry room right here with the smart panel. Then you have two bedrooms over here. You have bedroom number one. They're a little smaller in size with the closet. Then you have bedroom number two. Looks probably about the same size as bedroom number one. Then you have a full bathroom. And then you have the linen closet. Let's take a look in the primary bedroom. Some alarms going off or something. Let's see what this is. This is a closet. Then you have the primary bedroom with the slider right here. Then the walk-in closet. Okay. And then the primary bath. I like this setup. Um, I like having a, a shower and a tub. I'm a tub person. Damien's a tub person. I think the shower is a great size. Um, and a lot of people still believe in baths, you know, guys. <laughs> I know some people don't take it and think it's a waste of money, but this is a very good size bath. This is a, another one that's large. Yes, yeah, it's, it's nice. nice. Two people can take a bath at the same time. Think about that. Yeah. yeah. And then you have the double vanities here with the same um, cabinets as the kitchen. I like the wink, by the way. The wink? Mm -hmm. You winked? No, you winked. I did. Oh, <laughs> oh the wink of two people <laughs> could fit in the bath. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Hint, hint. No, just kidding. <laughs> Alrighty, so let me just go over a few things that will happen when you buy new construction. Um, let's go take out a picture, or let's go look at the backyard. I'm not sure if this home, the covered patio, comes with the home or not, but when you buy new construction, you're going to pick out where you want your home to be located, your lot. All right? Depending on size, you're going to have a lot premium and also depending on location of your lot. 
this seems to be a little bigger than some of the other lots that we have seen. However, expect to have smaller lots. When you buy new construction here in Vegas, we don't have acre lots. We don't have quarter acre lots. We don't have half acre lots. We have 5,000, 4,000 square foot lots, okay? And expect the houses to be close together because we are running out of room here in Vegas. So this is a very nicely landscaped backyard. But when you buy new construction, you pick your lot, then you're gonna pick out your structural options. And there's various different structural options like getting in the gas stub right here. I'm sure this slider right here off the primary bedroom is an extra structural option. Uh, the garage door on the side. There's a bunch of different structural options. Then a week or so after you go under contract, you're gonna meet with the design team and pick out all of your upgrades, your flooring, your countertops, your kitchen appliances, your countertops, I said that, your cabinets, etc. You're gonna pick out all the different light fixtures, you're gonna pick out your electrical packages, where the pendant lights are gonna go, if every bedroom's gonna have a ceiling fan, then you're gonna pick your tile, all right? This whole house comes carpeted with the exception of your wet areas, which would be your kitchen entry, bathroom and laundry. Everything else comes carpeted. I think these are the generic tiles that do come with the community, but you can also choose different kinds of flooring. You can choose luxury vinyl, engineered hardwood, wood, tile, whatever you choose. But know that whatever flooring you do choose will be an upgrade unless you go with a builder grade carpet that comes with the whole house. For me, as an added feature, I would select the upgraded flooring because then I don't have to worry about it after the fact. Some people say to go with the generic builder grade flooring and then do your flooring after the fact. But for me, I'm doing that right now and it does not seem any cheaper than having the builder do it yourself. Um, that way your house is done and you don't have to worry about hiring another person to come in and change out your flooring. But for me, I would spend the money on the flooring. It's very important. And if you had to have carpeting, just keep it in the bathroom. I mean, in the um, bedrooms. Because no one in Vegas likes flooring, right? <laughs> they don't like carpet. You're right. No one in Vegas likes carpeting. Mm -hmm. So that's where I would spend my upgrades. Then I would spend my upgrades on the electrical package because I want every room to be pre-wired for a ceiling fan. Yes, you could have an electric com electrician come in and do that, but that's not worth the Not one bit. So that is it, folks. I think I covered everything. If you're thinking about buying new construction here in Vegas, you need to call me at... 702-370-5112. Yay, he got it right. I'm making him memorize my phone number. <laughs> but most importantly, you need to... Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe to my channel because I sell a lot of new construction here in the Las Vegas Valley. I am your new home sales expert. You want me on your side to get you the best deal possible. Another side note real quick is that they do have three quick move in homes here in this community. When quick move in means all options have been selected and sometimes it's better to buy a quick move in because I don't know, maybe they'll offer discounts, who knows. Let me know in the comments what you think of this floor plan and make sure again, like, subscribe. See you guys on the next model home tour. Peace out.